Hey YouTube, Carlo here. Welcome to the vlog. This is the channel where we talk about sneakers, life, and tech. And yes, we will do tech very soon. So please wait. <laughs> For this vlog, I just wanted to share with you guys a sneaker sale surprise or secret surprise that I stumbled to when I dropped by the Capital Multibrand Sneaker Store over at SM Aura. Let's go! <laughs> If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, you are absolutely missing out because we're doing like four giveaways right now. We're giving away a ZX500 RM from Adidas. We're giving away a 10,000 peso outlet sneaker shopping uh, well, trip with me. We're doing a 3,000 peso sneaker gift certificate over at Carousel. And we're giving away limited edition Scrap Protect spray cans with the NBA. All you guys have to do is to subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell, follow me on Instagram, and hit the links down below for the rest of the mechanics. Go! So this story actually started uh, when my wife, who is a huge fan of Meghan Markle, Markle, Mer uh, yeah, the, the, the princess, <laughs> Meghan Markle, the, you know, the, the girl who used to star with over at the suits, uh, posted on, I think on Instagram, that she wore like new sneakers. And my wife wanted to buy the sneakers. The sneakers were from a brand called Veja or Veja. Uh, it is, I think, a Brazilian brand. I'm not too sure, uh, but I do know where to find it. I do know where to buy it. It's actually a brand that was brought here in the Philippines by Capital. Now, I will be talking about at length about that brand and what it represents and what it stands for, or how much you can get it for and all that stuff near the end of the video. So we went over to Capital to check out the store. Uh, we went inside and it's one of their newest branches, by the way, the one in SM or a really big store multiple brands lots of really cool sneakers but the best thing about it can be found at the back near the cashier because when i was going around the store just serving the land checking out what's there i was able to find a wall where they had like a lot of dope sneakers for sale and i'm not talking about like you know old 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 sneakers uh, that are like so out of season these are sneakers that were literally just a few months old and some of them already were marked down by 20 to 25 percent which made them really good deals so let's go over them so first up we have the new balance x90 i did like a review of this and i'm such a huge fan of this silhouette it is so comfortable it is so stylish and it is so practical because it's sold for just little less than 6,000 pesos. Now, if 6,000 pesos is still too much for you guys and you've been wanting to pop this sneaker, you can actually get it at Capital, well, at, at least I saw it at that branch, for 4,796 pesos, less than 5,000 pesos with a 20 or 25%, I don't know the exact amount, discount. Two or three colorways available together with the one that I loved and I eventually got for myself, the one with the white upper uh, with the accents. I think if it was like pinkish or reddish and then green or teal, really fantastic silhouette, really fantastic colorway. And if that doesn't appeal to you, two other colorways, the black with the pink and the black and the red or violet, I'm not, I'm not entirely sure. But yeah, fantastic value for money. Now moving over to the swoosh camp, the Nike Odyssey React, it's a step below the Epic React Flyknit. Uh, it's used to sell for a little over 6,000 pesos if I'm not mistaken. It's now going for just 5,036 pesos with the sale of capital. I think that's a fantastic deal, mainly because the Odyssey React is a sneaker that you can maximize because it is so versatile. You can use it for athleisure, for styling yourself up in a very casual way. You can use it for working out, be it for running or, you know, hitting the gym because of the React technology of Nike. Or you can just use them as daily beaters and beat the hell out of them. They would still look good and they would be so super comfortable. So again, the Odyssey React. Now moving over to the three stripes, we have the Pure Boost, not just any Pure Boost, this is the Pure Boost Go. Again, the Pure Boost Go just what? Came out like a few, three, four months ago, and it's already on sale. Now this one usually sells for 6,000 pesos. Now they're letting it go for 4,500 pesos. This is the black colorway with the white like net thingy at the back and the white thick white boost for the midsole. I highly recommend this pair. It is so comfortable. The cushioning is excellent. You can run with them. I think it's built for like lateral movement. So if you're running around the city and it's like sharp turns, you know, running down the street or around the street, this is built to support your feet if you do that. So again, less than 5,000 pesos for that. Now you can talk about sales and Adidas if you don't talk about the Alphabouts. 
because it is absolute insanity to buy an Alpha Bounce these days if you're going to get them for full retail knowing well that they usually end up at the outlet or at sale and that's the case here we have the Alpha Bounce Beyond which usually sells for I think a little over 5,000 pesos now down to 3,700 pesos and then after that, going back to the Swoosh Camp, we have the Hurachis. This is the triple white Hurachi, so very clean, very crisp, very easy to style and super comfortable to wear for 5,000 pesos. There's also another colorway, a brown bronze type of colorway of Hurachis that look really fire, really great. So I actually wanted to buy that when it first came out a few months back. And I was actually going to pick it up and buy it from Capital, but they didn't have my size, size 12, so tier. And lastly, we have the Adidas D-Rup Runners. Now, speaking of D-Rups, if you guys haven't watched my review yet of the Adidas Originals Dragon Ball Z D-Rup Runner Gohan, I'll put the link down below. I uploaded it like two days ago, if I'm not mistaken. One of the most funkiest novelty sneakers that I've seen in a while. Check it out, link down below. Now, speaking of the D-Rup Runner, this usually goes for 5,300 pesos. This one, this time around, they're selling it for 4,350 pesos. Now, those are just the sneakers that I saw that were on display over at Capital in SM Aura. There were still a lot more sneakers. They had like Jordans and a bunch of other Nikes, Pumas, uh, and yeah, a whole lot of, you know, sneakers for sale. Now, if you want to get a flavor of what those sneakers are, or if you can't go to a Capital store near you, what you can do is you can actually check out the website of Capital. Because most of the sneakers that are on, well, display, or even more than those, are actually on sale in their website. So all you have to do is go to the website, pick whatever it is that you want, buy and they ship it to you instead of you going over to the mall suffering the insane traffic that we have here in manila philippines to be able to just get it delivered to you without any hassle so again those were some of the great finds that i found at the surprise sale that i wasn't aware of for capital now speaking of veja or veja i don't know how you pronounce it properly this is actually a brand that uses recycled materials i think it's recycled plastic and recycled cotton as well as employs fair trade practices from the amazon rainforest for the rubber that they use for the outsole so it is ecologically friendly it is fair to local businessmen and that i think is the reason why megan or megan markle is the one or megan markle princess <laughs> but yeah megan uses it because it's not just your normal uh, pair of sneakers that are made from china or vietnam that are mass produced so there is a great selection of vegas sneakers over at capital for both women and men uh, the men's selection is actually pretty dope i mean the colorways that they had the styles that they had and i wanted to buy one but this is the reason why i actually don't shop at capital a lot and i hope this reaches the management of capital come on guys come on i'm begging you here i'm begging you here uh they don't usually carry size 12 and that's really annoying they usually just carry up to size 11 and as part of team size 12 that's a bit disappointing and frustrating especially when they have really cool sneakers like the one from veja that i want to cop so badly but they don't offer it or they have like scarce stocks so if anybody from capital philippines is listening is watching this video come on guys show some guys with big feet some love put in a size 12 or two for some of the sneakers that you have please now if you if you want to talk about regular priced items they have a lot of good pairs there uh the air force you the air force one utility in black and white these are the one that gives off the off-white vibes with the over branding writing along the sides and the back of the sneaker they actually had did a restock they're available over at capital this i think was the only pair on size 12 but I already had it, so I didn't end up buying it. So both in the black and the white colorway were available at retail. So if you want those, go cop them. Apart from that, we also have the insanely popular uh, Nike Cortez Forest Gump. For some reason, it, it, everybody's going crazy about it um, in the last few months. It's like getting the same amount of hype that the Fila Disruptor had when it was being pushed here in the Philippines. Now, everybody's talking about it. Everybody wants it. The prices by resellers are crazy. Even the guys at Green Hills who sell fake sneakers are hawking it like crazy. So again, if you want to get it for retail, you can cop it over at Capital. Now, speaking of the Nike Cortez, my review of the Nike Kenny 
uh, Cortez house sneakers will be dropping this Sunday. I know it's a bit late. It's a few weeks. I think it's a week late since it dropped, but better late than never. So watch out for that one if you guys are interested in that sneaker. Lastly, before we end, I just want to do a quick, you know, discussion about the loyalty program of Capital. If you guys want to maximize every peso spent, you have to research all the loyalty programs across all the stores that you shop. And Capital actually has a pretty good one. So all you have to do is accumulate purchases up to 20,000 pesos or 20, 25,000. And then after that, you get like the black card. And then with the card, you get like a perpetual discount, 10 to 15. I think, I'm not sure if it's 10 or 15, but I know it's within that range on all regular priced items. And when it's your birthday, you also get a bigger discount. So you can actually buy more sneakers at great value if you are a member. And lastly, you get X amount, X being the number of times, depending on how loyal you are, of sne free sneaker cleaning uh, per year. So if you have a dirty pair that you want cleaned uh, and you don't want to like use your own products or send it to professional cleaners, you can just have the guys over at Capital do it for you if you are a regular customer of theirs. And yeah, that's actually it for this vlog. Uh, if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please make sure that you do so. Again, we're doing a bunch of giveaways and it would be sad if you are not part of the pool when we draw the winners. And lastly, let me just state that this is not a sponsored video by Capital. It just so happened that I stumbled upon the great deals that were on their wall when I dropped by their store. So I hope you're all having a great weekend. Peace. God bless. What's up?